So to start off, we're gonna look at like a simple product definition of one of our favorite bicycles, the FA 10,000. And before I go into the design of this, I just wanted to show also that you have the ability with these responsive forms, that if I was to be running this on a tablet, let's say, I can now see that it resizes itself to fit on a smaller device. So that's really nice, depending on the type of device you're using. It'll even fit on a phone, uh, should you need to run it on a phone. So our FA-10000 bicycle has a master behind it, a bill of material and a routing. So to look at that, all we're going to do is go over to our engineering board. And this is a visual representation of what the routing and bill of materials combined look like. The real nice thing about this is I can see just by looking at this, the sub-assemblies required for the job rather than trying to read the indents of a text view. Uh, the dark blue represent operations or resources. Here's my final assembly area. And the light blue are materials. And some of those materials, you could see anything with a, what we call a leg, coming off of it represents a sub-assembly. So I can see that these first three materials are sub-assemblies and then the next three are just purchased materials that I would buy uh, or they could be manufactured and sitting in inventory uh, where I would issue them to this particular job when it becomes a job. So I can see that I do some assembly, I have a bunch of different materials that go into that assembly, then I do some inspection and I do some outside packaging. So we send that out to a vendor outside and we capture all of that, by the way, which uh, once we complete this first operation, Cloud Suite Industrial will automatically create a purchase order to that outside vendor for that service and so on. But I can see by looking at this, if I was to follow one of these paths that, for example, this uh, frame assembly, is part of my bill of material so I can see it not only has a sub-assembly or a uh, the sub-assembly here but it also has another level of sub-assembly associated with that so it will go as many levels deep as you need to to follow along seeing all of those bills of material so it's a complete indented bill of material in a visual view here and I can drill into the detail of, of these operations and these materials if I wanted to. But it's a real powerful.